Welcome! In front of me I have Xiaomi SmartBand 7 Pro and I'm gonna show you how to pair this SmartBand with the iPhone. First you will need to turn on the SmartBand and you can turn it on by plugging it into a charger. Once you plug it into charger, the SmartBand should turn on automatically. And after it turns on, you should see the list of languages on the screen. You can scroll through this list by swiping up and down. Now find the language you like to use on your SmartBand and tap on it to select it. Once you select the language, you'll, you'll see the QR code on the screen. You can use it to download the application on your iPhone and by scanning it, or you can simply open the App Store and download it from there. I'm gonna use the App Store method, method so I'm just gonna and make sure that I have the internet connection and the Bluetooth enabled on my iPhone. Then open the App Store. In the App Store, I'm gonna tap on search, then tap on the search bar and type in Mi Fitness. Then tap search. And on the list, you should see this application, Mi Fitness, formerly known as Xiaomi Wear Lite. Tap on it, tap on the get button to download and install it. And once the application is done installing, you can tap on the open button to open it. In the app, let's tap on the start button. Here we need to agree to the terms of use and then tap on agree. And now we can select the region or rather we need to. So tap on region, find the region you want to use. For example, United Kingdom, then tap on next. And now you should see the health page. So tap on the device icon right here, then tap on add device, then tap on OK. And here we need to log in into me account. And let me lower a brightness a little because it's quite bright. OK, this is better. So if you don't have an account, you can create a new one by tapping on create account or use the sign in using the SMS uh, method. I already have an account, so I'm going to tap right here, enter the email address oh, not emoji and then tap right here and enter the password okay once you're done entering the uh, email and password tap right here to check the box and tap on sign in and after you log in you'll get a couple of pop-ups about the permissions First, we have the notification permission. If you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on the smart band, you need to allow it. If you don't care, you can deny it. Next, we have the Bluetooth one. This permission is required, so let's tap on OK. Here, tap on OK. And the app should start looking for the nearby devices. It detected the device. I don't know why it's named like this. But if for some reason it doesn't detect your smart, smart band, you can tap on scan code and scan the QR code from your smart band uh, to connect the devices. I'm gonna tap on search again right here, and this time it detected the device. With, uh, it displays the name now, so we can for sure tell that this is our device. So let's select it from the list. Tap on the check mark to confirm. Tap on pair. Tap on uh, done, but as you can see, now we have more pop-ups about the permissions. Again, the notification permission, you can allow it or deny it. Location permission, you can allow it or deny it. And once you're done with the permissions, tap on done. And here we have the tutorial how to use the smart band. And we can go through it by tapping on next, and then we can tap on done. And here we can create goals for us, but I'm just going to tap on use default ones. And once you're done with the goals, you should see the device page for your uh, Xiaomi SmartBand 7 Pro. And of course, you can use your SmartBand now. And that's how you pair the SmartBand with the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please uh, consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.